If you're tired of using gel food dyes to make colored frostings for your cake, you need to check out Edible Art Paint. Watch this video to see my top tips on how to apply these on a Butterbean cake. For stress-free cake tutorials and advice, be sure to hit subscribe and click the bell to be notified whenever I post new videos. So this is Edible Art Paint. It's made by a brand called Sweet Sticks and they are amazing. They are super pigmented and I love that you don't have to add any water or vodka to them. You literally just have to shake pour and paint. I used to think that you could only paint on fondant cakes, but I realized that with these edible art paints, it's super easy to paint on a buttercream cake. So for me, I typically like to use a Swiss meringue buttercream to frost my cakes, but you can easily use American buttercream as well. And if you want to grab my foolproof guide on Swiss Marine Buttercream, you can check out that link below. All right, so tip number one, you want to work with a cold cake. The buttercream should be hardened and firm to the touch. You don't want to touch it and be able to have any buttercream on your finger because it means it's too soft. If you apply paint on a soft buttercream cake, it will just mess up the buttercream and the paint won't really adhere to the cake as well. Tip number two, you want to make sure that your buttercream is smooth. If there are any imperfections, gaps, or holes, the paint is going to emphasize this. Watch my video linked below to see how you can easily achieve a smooth frosted cake. Tip number three, use food safe brushes. So I got this one from Wilton and I love it because it doesn't shed and it's pretty full so that it doesn't have any harsh strokes when I paint on my cake. Don't do what I did and in the beginning I actually got this craft brush from Michaels and you can't really tell but the hair is just shedding. It produced really harsh strokes on my cake so definitely get food safe brushes. Tip number four, you want to apply the paint gently. You don't want to end up scraping off buttercream and producing a rough look unless that's what you're going for. And the great thing about these paints is that because they're pigmented, you don't need to add a lot to your brush in order to get the color to show through on the cake. Tip number five, work quickly. Especially if you're living in a warmer environment, the cake can start to melt. So you want to have your cake as cold as possible so that you produce that nice smooth look on your cake. And if you notice that your buttercream is starting to soften up a bit, you can just pop it back in the fridge or the freezer really quick and then keep going. So those are my top five tips on how to apply edible art paint onto a buttercream cake. Let me know in the comments below if you try these tips out, if you try these edible art paints out, or if you just have any other questions, I'd love to know and help answer them. If you liked this video, be sure to click like, hit subscribe, and don't forget to grab that foolproof Swiss Marine Buttercream Guide listed below.